I Promise by David McPhail. Baby Bear and his mother were splashing in the pool below the waterfall. Will you sing to me, Mama? shouted Baby Bear over the roar of the falling water. Later, dear, Mother Bear shouted back. I promise. What's a promise? Baby Bear asked us as they sat in the sun drying off. A promise is when you say you will do something, answered Mother Bear, and then you do your very best to do it. But what if you don't do it, said Baby Bear? Then it becomes a broken promise. Can you fix it? asked Baby Bear. Not easily, said his mother. That's why it's so important to keep it. Baby Bear was quiet for a moment. Then he said, I told Billy Bear I would play with him tomorrow. If I don't, is that breaking a promise? What do you think, his mother replied. Yes, said Baby Bear. I think it is, and that might hurt Billy Bear's feelings. I think you are right, Baby Bear. Mother and Baby Bear got up and walked along the riverbank. What else do you promise, Mama? Baby Bear asked. I promise to lie in the meadow with you, said Baby Bear and watch the clouds float by. Maybe we'll, we will see one that looks like an elephant, Baby Bear said excitedly. What else do you promise? I promise to listen when you have something to tell me, said Mother Bear. Like when I told you I thought there was a dragon under my bed, Baby Bear asked. Yes, exactly, replied Mother Bear. I remember that we looked, but we didn't find anything. And you stayed with me until I fell asleep, said Baby Bear, just in case. That's what mother bears do, his mother told him. They walked down to the orchard where the apples were nearly ripe. Mother Bear shook some from the tree. What else do you promise, Baby Bear asked. I promise to give you good things to eat, said Mother Bear, so that you will grow up to be big and strong. Will I be big as you, Mama? Baby Bear asked. Oh, yes, dear, said Mother Bear, maybe even bigger. Will you sing to me now? Baby Bear asked. Not now, dear, mumbled his mother, her mouth full of apple. Later, I promise. After a while, they walked toward the deep woods. What else do you promise? Baby Bear asked. I promise to teach you the things you will need to know about growing up, said Mother Bear. But I also promise to let you discover some things for yourself. I don't know everything. You don't? Said Baby Bear, sounding surprised. I don't, his mother replied. No one knows all there is to know. Do you promise I will always be happy? Baby Bear asked. Oh, I can't promise you that, said his mother. Your happiness will depend mostly on you, but I will do everything I can to help. Now they were on the path that led home. The sun had set and the moon was rising. Do you promise anything else? Baby Bear asked. I promise I will love you, said Mother Bear, always and forever. No matter what? Baby Bear asked. No matter what? Mother Bear promised. Baby Bear was very tired, so Mother Bear picked him up and carried him the rest of the way home. I can't wait to see Billy Bear tomorrow, said Baby Bear. I'm glad I promised to play with him. That must feel good, said Mother Bear. 
You will be keeping your promise and having fun too. When they reached their den, Mother Bear laid Baby Bear down on his bed and tucked him in. Can I promise you something, Mama? Baby Bear asked. Of course, dear, said Mother Bear. What is it? I promise I will be a good bear, Baby Bear told her, most of the time. Most of the time will do nicely, said Mother Bear. Then she sang to her baby until he was sound asleep. Good night, baby bear. I promise to listen when you have something to say, to give you good things to eat, to teach you about growing up, and to always love you no matter what.